Hey everyone, welcome back to Melissa's Kitchen Table. Today I have a BJ's and I hope to have a Trader Joe's haul for you. Um, today's Saturday when I'm filming this and I um, stopped at BJ's. I had gotten some coupons in the mail that I wanted to use. And then um, I stopped at uh, Stop and Shop on the way home and I'll show you what I got from there. Um, from Stop and Shop they had the bubbly on sale. And I've never tried the pineapple flavor, so it was on sale for $3, so I got a pack of that. Then I've been wanting to make some salmon, so I got their Nature's Promise Wild Caught Alaska Sockeye Salmon. Now, there's only two fillets in here, which is fine. Um, where it was located, it said, I think $8.99, but it rang up $11.99, so... I mean, for two pieces, if you go out to dinner, it's a lot more expensive, but, so I spent a little more than I had hoped to, but anyways, I got a ham that was on sale for 79 cents a pound. It came out to $7.09. I'm going to try curing my own ham for Easter, so this is actually going to be for Sunday dinner. I was looking for something else, but they didn't have anything, so that's what I got. All right. So the scrapping bubbles I don't need. Um, we are on our last can. So they were on sale, $2.50 off. I'll just show you the prices. It was $10.49 with $2.50 off. So I grabbed them because um, I don't go there often and will run out before I go there again. Then the pick and pack. Uh, is normally $6.98 and I had a coupon to save $1 so I got the Tostitos because um, I usually always make a dip for the holidays and then I needed another one so I just got the big blaze. What else? Let's see. Love their cheddar. I got the New York Extra Sharp. That was $6.29. The Daisy Sour Cream was only $2.99. The cream cheese was on sale. $11.99 with $4 off. Then, normally I don't get this. Um, I like Trader Joe's cottage cheese. Uh, but these came in these cute little packages. And they were on clearance or sale or whatever for $3.99. So I thought I'd give them a try. Got some of the Galbani string cheese. This is our favorite. And I had a coupon for that. And that was $7.49 with a dollar off. So we spent with tax $42.23. And just a word of advice, I don't know if all BJ's are like this, um, but they ask, like, uh, they're not accepting paper coupons, so they electronically deduct stuff. However, because this wasn't just the booklet I got in the mail, it was a special coupon sent just to us, because of, like, based off of what we purchase, you still have to scan those. So, um... Yeah, that's just my little tip there, and stay tuned. Hopefully I have a Trader Joe's haul for you next. Okay, so we're back with the second part of the haul, and I was able to get to Trader Joe's. They were extremely well stocked. I have to say that there were there was more items now than when I used to normally go. They had a ton, a ton, a ton of stuff. So kudos to Trader Joe's. And then we also stopped at the grocery outlet. Um, every now and then you get a good deal there. So let's start over there. Now, if you've watched any of my Grove Collaborative hauls, you'll know that I purchase this method, laundry detergent free and clear, all the time. I always wash all of our towels and bedding, sheets, blankets, all that stuff. I use the free and clear. Now, when I get this on Grove Collaborative, and I double-checked while I was there, it's originally $14.99. It was on sale for $12.99. However, they were out of stock of all of their detergents. So this was $8.99. Same amount of load, same size. Everything was identical, and that's a great price. I mean, a $6 savings is awesome. So they had three. I bought three. One of them I left in my vehicle to bring... Um, to the laundromat with me. If you know, I work at my mom's laundromat on Saturdays. So we got those $8.99 each. Um, I got a lot of green beans, but we went to this place last and they had this huge, what is it? A 24 ounce bag 
of organic green beans. This price is 99 cents. They were on clearance for 59 cents for this huge bag. They look good. I'm going to make these with Sunday dinner tonight. And then one night during the week, we're going to make ribs. So I'm going to try out this sweet and sour sauce. When I was growing up, my mom used to use these on um, like country ribs. So we'll see. And then they had this ball of dough for 99 cents. And I have no idea what I'm going to do with it, but I'll think of something. So I spent $32.21. And of course, these were $9 each. We got three of them. So at Trader Joe's, I'll show you so you can see the prices. So at Trader Joe's, I had already picked up these green beans for tonight's dinner, but I will save these. These were $3.29, and these are only 16 ounces, which is smaller than the other bag, but I already got them, so it is what it is. And our um, standard two things of baby cauliflower, love that stuff. Got a thing of, sorry, that was Kane. He's over here chewing his horn. And choking on it. Uh, I got to think of asparagus. That I think was $3.29. That was expensive. Let me see. $3.79. Wow. If I had known it was that much, I wouldn't have gotten it. Um, but we were trying to hurry while we were in there because you can, you have to be six feet apart from the people. But you also have to be six feet apart from the people working there. And if you've ever been to your Trader Joe's, you know how it is when they stock stuff. They don't move. They stay right there, and you have to go around them. So it was hard to look at a lot of stuff because they were stacking produce. But either way, got a three-pack of organic zucchini. And then their yellow squash looked really nice. There's two, four, five of them in here. They are small, but the smaller ones have smaller seeds, so they're better. Got another head of cabbage. I'm going to be making a ham with potatoes, cabbage, carrots. My husband won't eat cabbage, so that's why I'm making green beans for Sunday dinner. Then I had had this in a haul many months ago, the Kung Pao Tempura Cauliflower. We, let's see, I had it in there for a very long time. And we tried it maybe a couple months ago, about a month or two ago. This stuff is so, so good. Um, I put it in the air fryer. The Kung Pao sauce that comes with it is very, very good. This is very good. It comes out nice and crispy in the air fryer. We really liked it. So then for, I don't know, maybe the past month or so, I've been looking for it and they haven't had it. Uh, today they finally had it. So I grabbed two of them. They're expensive. They're $5.49. Um, but whatever. We got a thing of sweet sapphire grapes. I know I've seen these in other stores as Moondrop grapes. All the grapes are the same price, $5.49. So I grabbed one of these. I have to clean those. Got a three-pound bag of gold potatoes for dinner. Got some walnut baking pieces. We ran out of them. Then over here, they only had two chickens... Yeah, they only had two. This one's kind of big, but that's all right. It was $8.30. Got that for dinner one night. Some free-range chicken broth. I wanted to try this microdermabrasion scrub exfoliating cream. That was $4.99. And then I picked some of the mushroom uh, seasoning blend up. I think that's $2.29. I'm not positive. But yeah, that's what we got at Trader Joe's and the discount grocery. I hope everyone's staying well and able to find all the groceries that they need. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe and share, and I'll talk to you all next time. Bye.